Hello and welcome back to Root Kaiser's playthrough of Pokemon Perfect Crystal. Last time we chased half of the rockets out of the radio tower. Now we need to find some way into that basement. Huh? Could this be the door that the key opens? Apparently not. Looks like we need some other means to get underground. Oh, they didn't block off this side of the entrance, I understand. I was confused because they blocked off the other path. Everything here is way too overpriced. I don't think we're getting any of the prizes here. Which is a shame because I was kind of relying on a lot of the power to come from TMs, but there are no TMs in this game. Or rather, all the TMs in this game are, you know, bad. Looks like it worked on this door. Since I, I want to draw attention to a large difference between this and the original game. Because again, this is the modded version. It's very slightly modded, but it's modded all, it's all the same. You see I have a bunch of stones on me. We're going to take this time to evolve both Met. Oof, beautiful. We're also going to evolve Mia. See, I never had trade evolutions as a, like growing up, so I never got to use any of the trade evolutions like in-game. I always got them like post-game. After you've beaten the game and you're you and your friends were hanging out, that's when you do that's when I always did trade evolutions. So now we have two fully grown team members. But as I was saying about the eight, the lack of T, oh, T oh, it's you. The lack of TM moves is that I won't have access to a lot of useful stuff. Hold it! I saw you, so I you, you followed me. I don't need you underfoot, bro. You came in here behind me, and you're acting like I'm in your way. Wait a second. You beat me before, didn't you? Bro, I mean, I've beat you a lot, act, now that I'm thinking about it. Since you wanna go down memory lane, immediately doubles down on that. That was, that was just a fluke. But I'm still gonna get payback, even though I didn't technically lose to you. And I'm also not mad about not losing to you, because I didn't lose to you. Spoken like a true loser. Once the confusions start popping off, it's when I gotta leave. The TMs I was worrying about, I think one of which are like the big, so I, I just recently learned that you don't, we don't have access to any good move basically. So you can't get the uh, the three beams, ice beam, thunderbolt, and fire blast or fire flamethrower. You can't get any of those in this game until you beat the game, and you can't get the stronger, less reliable versions either, unless you can win it in the slots, which I don't think is gonna be like very likely for most people. Oh wow, Sneasel is really cool. How did he get a Sneasel? Wait a second. He shouldn't even have the chance to get one of the- Oh, I guess I'm I'm cheating just as hard, so I can't complain. Watch as I reveal my Caesar. Oh, the good old days when Steel used to resist Dark. But yeah, this game has been, you more or less, disappointment after disappointment. From the mystery egg, I thought I would be able to use... I thought I could at least get something cool. It was Pichu. Like, I think the plan I had originally was to use a uh, was to use a sunny day blossom, but I don't I, I'm not gonna be able to get sunny day until I beat the game, and I'm not gonna be able to get solar beam until the very end of the game. Like I planned my team around a very modern idea of what this game was like, only to realize that it's not like that. Unfortunate. I would say with the hard read, but I doubt he had any other move. Frogator. You know, I'm glad I finally get to discuss this. We're gonna heal real quick. Uh, for Alligator is a Pokemon who is basically stained with a, with a, a mark of incompetence. And I don't know why that is. Like, I understand why his name is abbreviated like it is in this game. Like, obviously, obviously, its name is for Alligator. Like, there should at least be an O or an E after, the, the, after that T at the end there. But there isn't. And there, and unfortunately, there never will be. Question of the day, do you believe for alligator should be spelled with a, a T-E-R or a T-O-R, like a proper gator? See, I always assumed it'd be E-R, personally. And now do I stay in or do I switch to Gloom? Damon, Damon's probably really gonna suffer. Th this Pokemon choice was made, like, with Gen 4 in mind, I guess. Cause I'm looking at it, I'm like, oh, we can learn Ice Beam, Thunderbolt, Surf and fourth move, it's, it should be a, a good a good setter. But you know, or Gen 2 be like, why, why do I lose? 
I've assembled the toughest Pokemon. I didn't ease up on the gas, so why do I lose? I followed all the steps, I did everything right. Maybe I'm just wrong. Love. Trust. Are they really what I lack? Are they keeping me from winning? I don't understand. I will never give up my dream of being the strongest Pokemon train. All right, later, nerd. Well, thanks to you, I had to go heal, punk. And this whole, like, TM issue, or move pool issue. Well, see, see, the TM issue is only an issue because the move pools are an issue, and the move pools are only an issue because the Pokemon are kind of not easy to get. Like, compared to how abundant most of these, most of these other things are. Like, Scyther is not that common. And getting a Caesar is even less common. Furio, I... Y you can't even catch this thing in the in the vanilla game. Which is like, eh, the, the issue with... The issue with Johto is basically that it's really fun to play, it's just a very, unfortunately, disinteresting Pokemon game. And, I guess, people always like, oh, this is a good game, but it's a bad X or genre game. And, like, th this... This, I feel like, is the greatest Pokemon example of it. Because it, it nails all the feel, all the enjoyment of what Pokemon is. It just sucks. And I feel like that's the mark of a, a bad or good game. How difficult is it to use Pokemon that aren't good? Because if if using good Pokemon makes the game easy, and, and that's all the, that's the option you have, what do you, then the game's not that good, now is it? Then what's the point of the other Pokemon? You should be able to use bad Pokemon to some effect. Otherwise, the game's moral, or the game's message kind of falls through. It's like, why why work four times as hard with with way worse Pokemon? The, when you can just get the same result with the, the same tried and true team you've been using probably for the past few, well, not few, but in this case, the last generation. And saying Johto has scaling issues, it isn't really anything new. That's probably one of the biggest complaints about Johto, it's scaling issues. I feel like more of a problem than that is how it fails so marvelously to hit the mark it's supposed to be hitting. But yeah, it's lame. Most of the stuff, most of the cool stuff is locked behind uh, post-game. It'd be different if they gave you enough to, like, satiate, but putting the, the elemental punches which, mind you, an extremely small amount of Pokemon actually get access to in in the department store and expect that to be like, oh, that's a, that's a good fix. It's like, hmm. The only reason I have any use for any of the punches is because I, for no reason, caught a... It's See, it's not even for no reason. The only reason I caught the mill tank is because I wanted to hit Monlee on my team, realized that I couldn't get a- I could not get a Tyrogue in any feasible way in this game, even in this hacked version, without either A, getting lucky, or B, beating the game. And it's like, what- what is the- like, the, the thing about post-game is locking features behind it is not enjoyable. Because that makes the game, to get to the post-game, unfortunately hollow and the post game itself kind of pointless because you are only racing to get here so you can get this thing and after you have it there's no real game to play anymore the fact that post game is such a constant like cry from pokemon fans i think is just testament to the game being poorly designed because you shouldn't need you you in theory shouldn't need post game in your game come on antidote oh well, crap Oh, I'm gonna try to tough it out. I'm gonna be real strong. Who? What? You came to rescue me. That's right. Here to save you. What do you think? What do you think all these people were doing keeping you locked in this basement? If not taking over your radio tower. Yoink. Ooh, the amulet coin. Oh, we're, under, we're, up, we're over here. Alright, new area, new places to explore. Second studio. I wanna talk to the I wanna talk to the talent! That meow reminded me to put the amulet coin I got onto somebody. Mia's gonna be our little moneymaker. I hope that loss was broadcast to everybody, including your boss. A clear bill. Maybe you should go to Tin Tower 2, old man. Since that's where I'm headed, we're gonna end it right here. It's been Big K in the morning. Oh, and next time. We're gonna unearth a bunch of ancient Jotinian secrets.